Hello, people. Another beautiful day. Yep. Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. What? What's up? What's up, gamers? All right, we got another nice, got a nice little article here for you. Talking about the Microsoft Activision uh, uh, Blizzard uh, court case again. Listen to this. Sony has produced documents for plaintiff in gamers' lawsuit. It says ten gamers have banded together to sue. To, to banded together to sue to block Activision merger under the Clayton Act, and Sony has provided key documents to plaintiff in the case. It says here ten gamers have banded together to to sue to block the Microsoft Activision merger under parts of the Clayton Act. And new court filings revealed that Sony has provided documents to the plaintiff. Hmm. Says here, uh, Microsoft wants to buy Activision Blizzard for $68.7 billion, uh, <laughs> representing the largest video game acquisition in history and also the largest acquisition that Microsoft has ever proposed. The trillion dollar tech firm attempts to uh, assuage antitrust concerns. A, the chief of which is making the 31 billion Call of Duty franchise exclusive to Xbox platform with multiple 10 year licensing deal to ensure the mega hit video game series remain on multi platform. While many gamers see the tr tremendous benefit with the acquisition, including the addition of Activision Blizzard titles to Microsoft popular all you can play Xbox Game Pass subscription, the deal faces staunch opposition from gamers and other industry players like Sony. Some gamers feel so strongly against the merger that they have banded together to collectively sue Microsoft in an attempt to block the deal. This is 3.22CV-08991-JSC Gamers Lawsuit filed in District Courts of Northern District of Northern California Courts. So the, says here, a new joint conference filing, Document 81, reveals some interesting development in the case. According to the filing, Sony has delivered two phases of documents to plaintiff legal counsel. Remember that Sony has vocally opposed the merger at every turn, going so far as to say that the deal is anti-competitive to PlayStation. Plaintiff have actually served multiple subpoenas and documents requests to relevant parties, including Activision Blizzard, uh, Nintendo, Sony, and Nvidia. Sony complied with these requests, with which are indeed well-timed opportunities to share per, 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 pertinent information for another lawsuit that could act as a hurdle for the merger. Others like NVIDIA, however, have not complied and refused to produce any document or engage with plaintiff until plaintiff have filed an amended complaint. Nintendo has likely, likewise, avoided this position. Nintendo of America President Doug Bowser was asked to deliver testimony before the court because the original complaint has been dismissed by the judge Jacqueline Scott uh, Corley. <laughs> Says page 4 of the joint update reads, on January 27, 2023, plaintiff issued a subpoena to Sony Interactive LLC, Sony, and its CEO Jim Ryan in lieu of a disposition at this time. Sony agreed to produce documents to plaintiff. Sony made a production of documents to plaintiff on March 9, 2023. Plaintiff issues a second subpoena to Sony with a, with a request for production of documents on March 10, 2023. After the entry of subpoena, sub, after the entry of supplemental, sorry about that, uh, protective orders with an outside counsel only provision, Sony has made a second production of material to plaintiff on March 17, 2023. Sony has advised plaintiff and Microsoft has confirmed that Sony will be producing these same documents to Microsoft. Hmm. Says Microsoft legal counsel say it is surprised to read that plaintiff received documents production from Sony weeks ago says the surprise here seems to be the quickness in which Sony delivered the documents whereas other parties seems to be reluctant especially given the lawsuit original complaint had been dismissed then it says in parentheses however plenty will have an opportunity to file an amend complaint 
and start over. Hmm. What also interesting is that Microsoft will in turn seek documents requests for its discovery period. Remember that these court case cases go through a phase called discovery, which is essential essentially a document gathering period. During this time both sides will subpoena or compel or other parties to produce information to aid in the case. This can include sales data, network information, and much, much more. Mm. And it says here, special thanks to Foss Patton uh, Florian uh, Mueller for assistance with this coverage. What's up, Tweaktown? And this article is from Tweaktown. <laughs> Somebody says in the comment section, God, it said, God, really Sony fanboys will do anything for them? It's crazy that Americans are suing an American company in favor of a Japanese company. <laughs> what happened to proud to be an American? <laughs> that was nonsense. It says, this country is going to, when you have people doing this in favor of an oversee company. <laughs> Man, let me read it. That's, 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 the, that's the end of the article. Well, 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 <laughs> remember the Matrix? You take the blue pill, nothing happens. <laughs> you take the red pill, and you see how deep, how, how far deep the rabbit hole goes. <laughs> so, um, this court case now is in discovery where everybody got to turn in paperwork. And they're due. And so the court case can go forward. <laughs> in the meantime, um, you know, the people, the, the gamers that filed the lawsuit, you know, I covered this before earlier, but. The judge, uh, uh, what's her name, uh, Jacqueline uh, Scott, uh, 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 dismissed the case, and um, uh, she uh, she wanted them to refile. Hmm. And Sony, they turned in paperwork to the plaintiff, but that means that to the plaintiff, but that means they got, to, but that means they got turned in paperwork also for Microsoft because Microsoft need to build their. Uh, case with the um with, with the FDC hmm. so this court this whole court thing now is in discovery everybody got to turn in their uh, their paperwork and um so this case can go forward or you know people that are involved have, they have an option to you know you know accept deals and back out the case because the more the more days that um, this case goes on, the, the, the longer this case goes on, the deeper the hole gets, you know? <laughs> so, uh, when, it comes, when it comes to this, man, um, you know, Activision Blizzard was really up for grabs. They were. So, um, you know, Microsoft beat everybody to the punch with this. And, uh, you know, uh, the UK, the CMA, they're like, okay, we didn't find anything wrong with this case, with with, the, with Microsoft purchase Activision Blizzard, but we are concerned about cloud gaming, but as far as we can see, this deal is not going to affect anybody, so, um, uh, <laughs> uh, Microsoft right now, they have support in this now. No, based on the CMA's finding, so they got the, they got uh, the case is gonna keep getting interesting. We're in April right now. We got June and we got July, so the cases every day going forward is gonna get pretty interesting to see where where everybody is on this whole situation. You know. Um, this case is an um, this case is an uh, is is a um, is a um, endurance game, man. So <laughs> this is an, an endurance game right now. This Activision uh, Blizzard uh, lawsuit is an endurance game, and um, they say pressure uh, <laughs> they say pressure bust pipes. So um, 
Microsoft is going to have to see this through. You know, they're going to have to see this all the way through. You know, keep going forward with this. Um, and, um, you know, the FTC, they got it. <laughs> they're trying to build a case. They want documents from Microsoft so they can build a case. But this is an endurance game. See, the FTC now, they can't rely on past history. Like, oh, well, back in 1906. No, nah, they got to they got to stay present. So uh, they got to come up with some new information, they, and they got to have some solid, some real solid, concrete evidence in this whole situation, man. Um, this court case is an is an um, is an endurance game right now. It's really an endurance game, you know. Um, so uh, you know, Microsoft has to be able to see this thing through. You know, um, if they made it this far with it, and Sony's main goal is to block the deal, but Microsoft is willing to negotiate with Sony if they want to. You know, is willing. You know, so um, <laughs> yeah, this is this is this is a test of endurance right now, because these months, you know, day by day, week by week, month by month, and um, yeah. You know, um, it's test. It's testing everybody. You know, it's a. Te it's testing everybody. I mean, getting. I mean, getting to the. Um, I mean, getting to the courtroom. I mean, filing. I mean, filing the case is one thing, man. <laughs> and then going through the, the process, man, is another, man. So yeah, um, this is a test of endurance, man. So. Um, Microsoft is not alone in this. <laughs> when you got Japan supporting Microsoft, and then you got Tencent and Nvidia supporting them, and then you got <laughs> the Ukraine, Chile, Saudi Arabia, and these are gov countries and government, they got some say in the matter too. So, <laughs> yeah, this is a test of endurance, man. Um, yeah, this is an this court case is an endurance game right now. It's an endurance game. And, um, we're going to see um, what the end result is going to be at this, but um, going to be for this, you know. But um, the FDC, the CMA is watching, the CMA in the UK is watching Microsoft, but they're also watching Sony. The FDC is watching Microsoft, but they're also watching Sony. So these, these, the CMA, the UK, they're all like, okay, okay, who's, who's going to, it's like, okay, are we gonna continue going with this, or who's gonna turn into who's gonna turn into um, who's gonna turn into uh, the white flag and just say, you know what, you know, okay, fine, you know. So, um, for us, the gamers that um, that filed a lawsuit, um, to me, um, they really don't have a case, man. They really don't have a case. They uh, they got their case dismissed. So, and that takes a, I mean, that it humbles you. You know what I'm saying? So the question is now: Are you gonna go back and file again, or are you gonna be like, you know what? This is this. Maybe we bit off. Maybe we bit off more than we can chew. You know? Maybe we need to stay out of this. This is between Sony and Mike and Microsoft. You know? So this this is a test of endurance right now. This court case is a, is a test of endurance, and that's what this comes down to now. It's an endurance game, and you know the the FTC they got a hard fight on their hands because they cannot rely on what happened back in um in 1900s or the 1950s. That stuff is dead. We're talking now. So they got a tough fight on their hands. And I mean think I mean and then think of the financial uh uh the money that is costing you daily now to go to court, you know, so it's a test of endurance, man. So um it's it's gonna come down to now who's gonna turn who's gonna turn in the white flag. That's what's gonna that's what this is gonna come down to, you know. 
And then you have Activision now. Their attorneys, they're not backing down from the FTC. Neither is Microsoft. So, yeah. <laughs> this is a test of endurance right now. And these days, we're in the month of April. Then there's May. Then there's June. Then there's July. Yeah. This is, this is, a, this is a test of endurance. This is an endurance game right now, you know, and you got to have, um, <clears throat> yeah, uh, this, <laughs> yeah, it, I mean, a lot of information you got to give up, you know, in this court case, you know, you know, the CMA looked at it, <laughs> the FDC, they're like, okay, they're, they're watching everybody, man, so, yeah. Hmm. This is a test of endurance. This whole court case right now. Huh? I mean, all these filings that they're doing, and it takes, it takes, it takes damage on your body too. <laughs> it, it takes damage, you know. It takes em physical damage, mental damage, and emotional damage, man. So, yeah. Hmm. This court case is not is gonna come down to like. <laughs> you know who's who's gonna who's gonna be the last man standing in this, you know? This is an endurance game right now. You know? Yeah. Because the FTC they got a decision to make too. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. It's an endurance game, people. That's what this game, this score case comes down to right now. It is an endurance game, man. Um, you know, um, when when money when when lots when when <laughs> when cases get big like this, man, um, it all comes down to an endurance game, man. You know who can who can withstand it, you know? Who can endure it? Who's gonna be the last man standing in this? <laughs> I mean, Microsoft already bought Activision Blizzard. <laughs> the deal is already done. <laughs> but now, you got to go through the, the FTC, CMA, UK. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. And then you got countries now. There, you got countries and you got game studios now. They're taking sides and, yeah. This is an endurance game from here on out, so. I'm going to keep you guys posted on this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that, 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 that court system is no walk in the park, man. <laughs> it's no walk in the park, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it, 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 take, it, take, it takes its toll on. It's taking its toll on everybody, man. So, you know. Um, this is an endurance game. This court, this this is an endurance game right now, and we'll see who the last man standing is. Okay, we'll leave this video for y'all to enjoy. <laughs> nice talking to you people again, Chris. Still a Star Wars, a Star Trek thing. Or Dark Side. Go. Peace.